wicked ass shit, man. Hey, yeah, man, my fucking wicked ass man, boss. Your head should be fucking bad yeah, shit, man. man. I remember, I remember I was telling y'all while I was working, you know, my fucking boss was a fucking faggot and shit, man. And they ordered us some food and shit. And I asked for a Greek salad. And I was doing a spin down the time and shit. They said, well, I don't have a Greek salad. All they got is toast salad. I said, all right, well, give me that. And you know, they fucking made a joke out of this shit, man. And I gotta fucking, you know, I, this is shit I gotta fucking deal with. You know, yeah, man, because that's, that's the same, man. Motherfuckers licking yeah. ass and shit, man. And I was like, the fuck? You know, I walk it all over there, all fucking laughing and shit. He said, yeah, you wanted to tell us, you want a soft toss salad, right? Yeah, and I'm like, yeah, I'm like, yeah, yeah, I had to, like, just grab my shit and be serious and walk away, man, because, you know, I, I knew what the fuck they was talking about, but this the shit you got to deal with in this fucking society, man, because everything's been fucking uh, name shit, man. You know, like your brother said, you got your red wings yet. You know, everything is symbolic with Esau, man. Just like uh, and also, also, do y'all know the beef? Have you ever been around a group of Edomites, man? And like you the only black guy there, and and and, and motherfuckers spit. You know, that's you no, know, that's actually derogatory, man. So like you ain't shit, cause they'll be sitting there, man. They'll just be like, yeah, just spit. You know, cause you that man notice that shit when you get around him, man. Cause Esau well, is a demon, yeah, man. But he's a faggot, though. Yeah, you man. So he won't secret and secret. Say, yeah, God. I like, hey man, when I hey, when I was in the world, I like to fight. Man. Yeah, man. <laughs> if I don't fucking like, hey, I'm gonna just, I mean, I'm gonna, yeah, walk away or go fuck you. Hey, I was that guy that to run up on a group of niggas and start stealing on niggas, man. Look, when I was when I was out there, we was, hey, we was in the military. We getting fucking bar fights, man. Fucking up Marines. <laughs> they ain't tough as they act either, man. A lot of them niggas are weak as hell. You know. Yeah. Bro, hey man, when I was in rock, man, bro. Well, that's because of the society. Hey, bro, I, hey man, the Lord know, the Lord know you can bear that shit. Cause I, hey man, I've been ready to put some rat poison in that faggot's yeah, pretzel. Yeah, man. Nah, I fucking, I walked off man, grab my shit. Watch that nigga foam to death. Yeah. <laughs> Set a rat poison in his pretzel. Decon, Defcon one, whatever they call that shit. <laughs> All right, bro, you got some more there? Defcon, Decon. Oh, Decon. In Psalm uh, 50, I'm going to read 16 again. It says, But unto the wicked, the most I said, What hast thou to do to declare my statutes, or that thou shouldst take by covenant in thy mouth, seeing thou hatest destruction, and casting my words behind thee? But you know what? Hey, man, you, hey, you right, though. You, hey, you, you doing right, bro. I mean, but like I said, hey, I did, I did what I had to do. You know, I worked that job and did what I had to do, man. But like I said, man, this is the hey. shit that we got to deal with, man. You, you got fucking right. niggas at your job. Matter of fact, you brothers at work, man, watch at your job. Man, day before, matter of fact, I think Halloween falls on a fucking Monday. I bet you your fucking boss tell people that work there to, to fucking dress up, man. My boss, I, I motherfucker better not tell you, hey man, I need y'all to participate. Man, participate in my ass. Matter of fact, I'm missing, I'm missing Friday, uh, Monday. You know, cause yeah, cause cause most most of these all jobs, man. You go out to places, man, they, they tell their workers to participate in Halloween, man. You go to to restaurants, the fucking the, the people that work there be dressed up and shit, man. That's some bullshit, man. All right? Okay, that's it. Yeah, Titus. Yeah, Titus. Go Titus out. Go ahead. It's the book of Titus, chapter 2, verse 3. The aged women likewise, that they be in behavior as become of holiness, not false accusers, not giving too much wine, teachers of good things. See, the aged woman can't be have righteousness, man, but she, she ain't taught it. She hasn't learned it, man. She's learned that bullshit in the churches, man. So she's going to, in turn, teach her, her kids that same bullshit, man. See, that's why we got to be tore down from all this bullshit, man. I, I was explaining to the old girl, like, you got to be tore down from this shit, man. What, what's the difference between us and Christianity? Well, really, you know, look at the word. You know, somebody calls us Christians, oh, well. You know, but we don't, Christianity has been turned into a doctrine, man. Everything in this world has been turned into what Esau plan is, man. So you gotta be stripped of that bullshit, man. He's in his education system, man. That's right, man. Yeah. All right, so if you don't know where to get it from, how the fuck can you teach it? What, a, what, the, what, 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 what age woman know how to raise, raise a child, man? She don't know shit, because guess what? Now that I tell you, her husband was a fucking Baptist preacher. And so on and so on and so on, man. So you have to be retaught again, man. That's why. That's why this is a new song, man. All right. We, yeah. we, hey, we, you, go ahead, sorry. brother. Oh, go ahead. Come. No, no. Hey, 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 another thing, man. Christianity is it was something that was taught to you by your enemy. That's right. Yeah. That's right. How can you ever use your enemies? Yeah. 
a, a gall, a doctrine yeah. to get ahead, man. That shit was taught to you by the same people that was whooping your back for not picking enough cotton, man. Yeah. yeah. But niggas, hey, hey, I'm gonna take this and make it good. Hey, man, hey, if, if you gotta take something and make it good, man, it can't be the truth. It can't be right. Because the truth is already good, man. Hey, you, you just got to search it out. Yeah, brother. Hey, mm -hmm. and that movie, uh, that movie, Nat Turner, man, that, uh, you know, another reason why that, that they were saying the movie didn't do good, man, I, that movie wasn't promoted like like other movies usually are promoted, man. It actually did, actually, because it was an independent film. Did they he say already, that? He already made all, all, my, all way more back. much money than what he put That's cool. It. That's good. That's good. Yeah, because see, because, man, because because they show you that in the movies, man, but niggas go man. to movies for entertainment. We go for, for the spiritual aspect of it, man. Hey, man. We man, get something movie. out of all, all movies, man. Come, it, hey, me and this brother, me and this brother went to see the movie. It was only six other niggas. Damn I mean, I'm saying, man. Man. Hey, they was niggas. There were only six other niggas in there, man. Six other, six other of our people in there. On the second day that the movie came out. Fuck that motherfucker theater should have been packed, man. Because, you know, ain't no nigga trying to hear about oh, how our people suffered in this country and went through slavery. Niggas ain't trying to hear that no more. The fact that we had to fight every day to get to where we are now has it, it, become, it's become like a, a thing of the past. Right, brother. Hey, ain't, Like, to I, hell with my ancestors. Come on, bro. That's how I'm niggas think. Now. To hell with my the people that got beat on those slave ships. Yeah, man. Come on. To hell with them niggas. That ain't me. And that movie should have got. Now out of all the slave, I know all, most of them were good, good. But out of all the slave movies that ever came out, man, that one there should have been that that book should have soared past the box offices, man. We been talking about Matt Turner, man. Everybody basically knows about Matt Turner, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hey, that hey. movie should have soared, man. Hey, that's cool because you know what the scriptures say? Hey, the, the elect of a t have what, obtained yeah, the have rest obtained, of the Con, nah, con. All these other niggas, man, hey, 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 it was about the right number of people in there. Yeah. Because all you other niggas gonna die anyway if you right, watch brother. it. Con, con. <laughs> Even if you watch it, you're gonna die, man. But we was hoping that people would be in there so they, they can get a rise out of them, man. Yeah, yeah. Because, you know, the scriptures say who should, who, who should rouse him up, man. Yeah. Jacob's yeah. as an old lion, man. Hey, our people is like an old lion. You know, the young lion come in and beat the, the pride leader and take over the pride, and he just sitting over there in the corner. That's how niggas are, man. Niggas don't want to fight for nothing, man. That's right. Hey, hey, they look down on you, us, us for coming out here, man, and reading the scriptures, man. Because ain't no fight left in these niggas, man. Ain't no fight left in these people, man. All these people want to do is humble down. Yes, sir. Go home and get a, get a husband a hard time. You know what I'm saying? Go home and get a family a hard time. But when, when the white man, yes, sir, boss. Yes, sir, boss. I got you, boss. <laughs> That's crazy. It's man, true. That's crazy because he saw he saw he was control the right, man. The riots that be jumping, popping off. Yeah. He saw we in control of that shit, man. There ain't no real riots, man. Yeah. <laughs> hey, they be happy when you niggas burn up your own store. Yeah, oh, we've been man. trying to get rid of that store for decades. <laughs> so you niggas have to come swing your money in our neighborhood. <laughs> they be happy. Hey, but you know what? Hey, Jake ain't in the mind to to, to give a fuck about this shit anyway. Hey, spiritually, we don't, we want to get the fuck out of here, man. Work. Any brothers ever heard of Niggas don't know target? why they pick up a, a rock and yeah, bust, a, bust out a window at an abandoned house. They just do it. Yeah. Ain't, no, ain't no reason behind it. Uh, hey, why am I gonna do this? Yeah. Nigga be like, it's a window there, I'm gonna break it. <laughs> hey, why you do that? I don't know. I just do stuff. That's why niggas like you Because I'm black. That's why niggas don't like you so much. Just do it. Yeah, man. Just do it. And you know what? That's, that, that, that's, that Nike slogan is putting out is putting out a a, 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 a a wicked vibration on people. Just do it. The niggas love. Well, really, that's the hey, niggas love. That's uh, Alice's Crowley's. Uh, that's yeah, that's, 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 that's that same thing. Yeah. Just do it and and, and uh, do as I will. I'm thinking that's basically the same do. thing, man. And they hit you with that subconsciously, so they can so they can hijack your mind without you without you being aware of. They want to hijack your mind. And, and, and you and you be like, oh, ain't nobody hijacking my mind. I know what I'm doing. 
<laughs> I know what I'm doing. But niggas, hey, hey, niggas singing that. Hey, niggas save up their whole check and go get a pair, a pair of Nikes or a pair of Jordans. Yep, yeah. You know, or, or niggas save up their whole. Hey, hey, them, 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 uh, them, 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 uh, Patrick Ewan's back out. <laughs> niggas be wearing them. Niggas save up their whole check to go get a pair of shoes, man. Go ahead. Anybody was reading? Likewise, that they be in behavior as become of holiness, not false accusers. Not false accusers. That means you, you, a lot of you old biddies going around gossiping about what, what, whatever the hell's going on without no true knowledge. Right. Yeah. About what such and such and such and such and I'm saying. Yeah. You know he what? He said, she said. And, and you know what? And that's the spirit, man. I can see why y'all was shy. Don't dip. Hey, man, because she asked me, that little chick asked me, you know, so uh, y'all don't let, uh, so, so y'all don't go to church. I can see why y'all was shot on dwell in building, because guess what, man? When you ever you got a place where a lot of women dwell, yeah. man, you got confusion, bro. You, you know, you can see it on, on certain brothers' videos, man. Yo, know, you'll be teaching a dude, man, and a fucking nigga woman to come up, man. Yeah. And just throw all type of confusion out of nowhere. Man. That's why the Lord ain't dealing. That's why the Lord ain't dealing. Hey, man, you know, if y'all was so fucking righteous, man, why y'all ain't out teaching on the corners, man? Why you on fucking uh, uh, social media trying to fucking teach me it, man? You right. Why don't I see? Why, why don't you just go ahead, get a couple of signs made up, and, and, and get some women group? You know why? Because you know you motherfuckers hate each other. Yep. Women hate each other, man. You have a couple of high five and the talking shit, man. But y'all not going you're not gonna come together like that, man. That's why this thing is for men. Exactly. That's why, man, we are the heads, man. You be having a bitch trying to rebuke her. He's like, yeah, y'all bitches need to get Yeah, man, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Then you'll have a fight, man. Exactly. They'll be fucking brawling, man. I, I got a, I got a fucking, I, 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 man, I, man, that's why, I'm going, Lord willing, man, I'll I, I be coming home in the next week or two, man. I, I fucking got to deal with, with, I, with my living quarters, man. I come home, they fucking watching uh, uh, basketball wise, hip hop, all that. And them bitches got money, man, and still act the same fucking way, man. I don't understand. Why would you cut on your TV to watch how motherfuckers else live their life? And they rich. <laughs> I don't understand. They fucking I, rich, I, man. That's what I asked, yeah, asked, asked the customer like that. She, yeah, my basketball house. I was like, can I ask you a question real quick? <laughs> um, what, I just was like, you can just ask me. Why do um, so many, you know, people like watching reality TV of other people how lives are feel? It's like you just wanna, you know, they right, famous right. and they people look up to them and you just wanna know how they live. I'm like, but, but do don't really, but don't people have their own problems? Yeah. Like but I was right. just hitting them with logic. It's yeah. Just, but, like, yeah, why do I watch But that you know shit? what? But cause, cause, cause <laughs> guess what? Cause cause people watch people watch those reality shows to escape from their reality. Mm -hmm. Cause their reality is really what hits home, man. Your reality. Yeah. Man, ain't nowhere the fuck them people living it's, uh, like that. Same reason they get high. It's called yeah, scripted. Same. It's called scripted reality. It's scripted reality, man. Those with they ain't living like that, man. Bro, if I was on that show, man, my wife, bro, if I was a basketball player, and my wife just baby, they wanna have us over. I said, bitch, look, <laughs> don't you ever you raise your mouth to you open your mouth to say, can't we be on a show? Like hell no, man. Well, Michael, you you see Michael Jordan on there? <laughs> you can tell the motherfuckers who's struggling. You know, because that motherfuckers that's on that show, man, ain't making no fucking money, man. Hey, hey, you know what that is? That whole reality show spill, that's a that's a, a new tactic to keep yeah. you niggas. I just saw a cherry. That was a that was that's a that's a new tactic. A new tactic to keep you niggas fighting amongst each other. Yeah, another that's form. Yeah, yeah, another form of propaganda, man. Yeah. Because that's all you niggas do. Because guess what? Uh, 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 yeah. Facebook. Everybody ain't got internet, so you can't see all the fights on Facebook and and and, and, and YouTube and and and, and uh, 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 what's the what's the other one? Uh, world star yeah. nigga hop. Yeah. Um, you can't watch that shit. But guess what? Everybody, everybody probably got a cable station to get get basketball wise. Yeah. 
Everybody watching that shit. You know, and every, every episode, man, it's a fucking fight, man. Every episode. Or some type of beef. Uh, some type of some type of beef, man. Such such don't like such such. Yeah. Yeah. Or, or somebody going to jail. Yeah. Or, 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 or somebody fucking somebody else, and you want to know them. But you know what? You know why they do that though? If they showed a black family, a Jake family, living how they supposed to be living, niggas oh. would get bored. Hey, that. hey, guess what? And they, they had a show like that with uh, what's her name? Damn, the chick that played the Inkwell. Vanessa Dale Calloway. She played in a show that uh, show, showed some predominantly, it was better than the Cosby's. It showed a predominantly, uh, it was a family, and they had their own problems. They said the show didn't do well, man. But it did do well. The network, the network canceled it, man. The network didn't want it, man, because it showed black people as a as a positive force, man. Yeah. Anything that showed you are, brother. Anything that show our people being positive and, lo and and showing love to one another, they they don't want that and they don't want that on TV. That's right. They want they want to see niggas acting like wild dogs, hyenas. Right. Right. They want to see people acting uh, uh, acting uh, 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 mean evil towards one another. They want to see. Uh, people uh, sleeping with each other's wives. That's the that's the that they uh, uh, that they try to push. I get out of here. Yeah. Like it came out last week. You said our people really only interested in controversy and with all that uh black uh how much you know, about basketball wise and all that shit. Yeah. Then it, it's so controversial. You might have your favorite. Your other these other nigga women they got their favorite. Then yeah. you arguing. Then you talking about the next. You know, two three hours going off the day. Yeah. Basically, they know it. And all of us, is, all of us, created man to keep your mind focused off, off what what's really happening, man. Yeah. The news, what's happening in Russia. Off the elders, off the prophets, man. That's out here preaching, this, teaching this truth, man. Cause people got want answers, man. I know I can I can go to my sister. I can I can talk to my. Basically, you can talk to anybody, man, and engage in a conversation about what's what America, what's coming to America. All right, man. Shalom, 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 my. You can basically engage in a conversation to anybody. What do you think the plight of America is, man? People actually are, are like 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 shrugging their shoulders, man. My son just had, that was you that told me, he said he asked, uh, yeah. he was in line, he said, uh, he said Trump or, or Hillary, Trump or Clinton. And he said the white guy was all bold, like, like he said, I'm white, you're black, who you think I'm voting for? You know, the dude was all rude and shit, like, man, what you think? You know who I'm voting for. You know, because really, man, it basically, what it is, is basically you can look at this election and say black and white, because Hillary's so-called supposed to be for blacks. And, and and Trump is for whites. So basically that's what he was saying in a nutshell. And then after that, I was like, I asked the cashier, I was like, what are you doing? Both of them fucked up. And she was like, don't do shit. And I was like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, man. So yeah, bro, so this, this place is, you can have a, a general conversation with anybody, man, and they know the downfall of this place, man. Yeah, man. They really just, they just shrugged their shoulders. They don't know the downfall, but Jake, it's Joe trying to sit by the sidelines and wait to see what's going on. But guess what, man, it's gonna be too fucking late, man. It's gonna, cause that's why y'all was shot, man. Says choose you this day who you should serve, man. Yeah. All right, cause Jake, Jake don't want to serve nothing, Jake man. Loves to but, but, yeah, Jake, basically loves Jake want to struggle the fence, man. He don't want to. He, he want to. Well, know, Lord, I, I love you, Lord, but America might got 25 more years. I want to kind of be in the world. and I want to be on your side. Get the fuck out of here, man. Yeah. Hey, my dick is in this man's wife, but my hands are on you, Lord. Right, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm sick, and sick shit, man. Yeah. Nigga, I man. was fucking her, but I was thinking of my wife, though. So yeah. Was it completely? I was <laughs> thinking of my wife. <laughs> Man, niggas, man, hey, all niggas know how to do good is sin. Yeah, that's right. Hey, the scriptures say it, man. That's right. They are wise to do evil, evil yeah. but to do good, they have no knowledge. Right, no, bro. You tell a nigga something positive, he don't know how to take it. That's why you get emotional. Yeah. Yeah, man, like that nigga, man, you know about the eighth day, man, get your ass out here. Really? At first, when he came up, it was like, Shalom, we was cool with him. But then he started trying to try to spew that vein. No, well you know what I told him, I said no passing no pictures, man. Then he was like, they're like, forget me. Cause cause you know he probably watched the oldest. So he already knew about the picture thing. You know what I'm saying? So he was like, no, nah, no, nah, man. But anyway, uh, then he gonna get all of his motherfucking prideful mode. Y'all you know, you know, you know about the eighth day? Like what? The fuck? Fuck, fuck the eighth day. You know what I'm saying, man? Get the fuck out of here, what, man. What? <laughs> Every day in Babylon is evil and wicked. Both of them suck equally. Yeah, right. Exactly. I hate every one of them bitches. Nigga talking about the eighth day. That's right. Dude, bro. Alright, you got something? Uh, yeah, read that. Jeremiah 4, 22. For 
for my people are for my people is foolish. They have not known me. Hey, 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 you said my people is foolish, they have not known me, man. That dude talking about the eighth day, I bet you ask him what the Lord name, he, he don't say he, he don't say the right name. Yeah. Cause he focused yeah. on the wrong thing already. Yeah, he is, man. That nigga gonna say Yeshua, Yeshia, Ahia, whatever he hey, but he he not gonna say you how about some young shit. Because you know what? He wouldn't ask him what eighth day was if he was in the right spirit. Go ahead. They are sottish 